Greetings, my friends, and welcome to the Christian Business Connection TV show. I'm your host, Prophetess Nona Thomas, and you know I got to declare that this is the day that the Lord has made. I will, I must, I have to rejoice and be glad in it, and I hope you are too. We have an extraordinary program today with some extraordinary guests, and we're going to get right to it. Call somebody, tell somebody, text them, let them know that the CBC television show is on right now. Stay with me now. I'll be right back. Welcome back everybody to the Christian Business Connection TV show. I am so excited about my next guest. You know, all of our guests are extraordinary that we have on this program, but here is a entrepreneur for real, for real, okay? She is truly doing it in the St. Louis metropolitan area. I wanna welcome to the CBC television show, Ms. Camille Childress, who is the founder and CEO of Inspiring Angels LLC. Welcome. Thank you for having me. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome. Now, I got to ask you the question. I ask everybody this question. You've been on my radio show. You know, is this the day that the Lord has made for you? It is. Today is the day and every day. Rejoicing. Glad about it. Yes. Good, good. You know, um, you're going to be back on another one of our programs, but I want to focus in today on Inspiring Angels. First, I love the name. Thank you. I love the name. Thank and I'm going to ask you right off the top, how did God give it to you? Well, I think it was manifested into my spirit because that's how I try to plan things in mm -hmm. my life. Mm -hmm. So I just was contemplating on, you know, starting home care. I worked in Northview Village for a very long time. I rave on this all the time. Oh. I'm also a nurse. So I started there at um, about 2010 and then, you know, working mm -hmm. with our community. Sure. I loved it. You know, a lot of people complain about Northview Village. They hate it. But I actually loved it because I liked working for our community. It was it was a it was a challenge, but it was a lesson learned. But it made me want to, you know, get off into the home care side because my grandmother, she really was in home care first. Yes. And working beside her in the nursing home. I yes. just really manifested that name and God put that in my spirit and gave me that. And you know, we gotta say her name, the Anita incredible, Wilder. the amazing. Anita, Anita, she is phenomenal. Anita she Wilder, is. she is phenomenal. So it's, I see, I see where you got it from. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. And also because, you know, that spirit of helping and, and, and being involved in the community, uh, that's important, isn't it? It's important and it's also a challenge. You know, every day in home care, service in three counties is a bit, can be stressful, mm -hmm. but you know, I just continue to pray and God shelters me he and he knows my heart. Mm -hmm. So he knows that I was built for it. Yeah, yes. yeah, you are. And so you're right, you're everywhere. You're in Potosi, Missouri. Of course, the St. Louis County and St. Louis City. You're in Kansas City, yes. Missouri. You're in Troy, Alabama. Yes. So you're traveling, you're doing a lot. I travel, but I also work a lot remotely because I have children. So it all balances out. Yeah, yes. yeah, it does. But it's so fulfilling, isn't it? It really is fulfilling. Yeah. Tell it us is. about some of the services that you provide. Well, I know we have plenty of staff. I mean, well, nurses on staff. So mm -hmm. we specialize in skilled nursing, mm -hmm. consumer direct services. Mm -hmm. That's where your loved one gets paid to care for you. And mm -hmm. that's a very a popular program, yeah. Medicaid-based program. Sure that a lot of the community is aware of. I also do personal care, in-home services, mm -hmm. respite care, mm -hmm. sitter, mm -hmm. overnight, mm -hmm. and all of your generic cleaning services we can mm -hmm. help, mm -hmm. transportation, and also disinfecting for COVID-19. Ooh, let's pause right there. You say disinfecting for COVID-19. Now that's that's where we are right now. Tell us about that service. Well, we added a benefit service to what we provide because when the COVID-19 pandemic hit, we had to find something that was going to help fight the virus right. in so many ways. Right. 
but we have a product that we subside and it kills COVID-19 less than 60 seconds on contact. So it's actually like a fogger that we come in and we disinfect airborne pathogens. I love it. Now, is this not only for residents, but for businesses as well? Businesses, residents, and mm -hmm. uh, you know, business owners mm -hmm. to help them thrive productively in the pandemic. Without worry. Without worry. Oh my goodness, <laughs> that is great. Uh, you know, one thing that I love that you're doing is, um, it's like you have all these different paths. You have these different, I mean, because you're, you're, you're multifaceted, okay? Yes. There's so mm -hmm. much, and we're gonna uh, make an announcement soon. We're not gonna do it now about another business, yes. all right, that you are going to open. And I know it's gonna be successful like the rest of your businesses are. Yes, but speaking to the entrepreneurs who may be watching this program or people who are thinking, speak to that, would you? I can only speak from experience because I've had so many no's. I tell you, I come from a background where my life has not been always great. Mm -hmm. I have eight beautiful children and just imagine multitasking that as a single parent. Wow. And you know, so I just think that my family, my mom, my grandmother, my children, my sister, they really kind of motivate me mm -hmm. because I see the envision. You know how you can't really see the light sometimes when you're investing your all into a business, right, right. but I see the light at the end of the tunnel. I know that God has brought me a long way and I know that I can't stop. Mm -hmm. So even I had opened a private event center and the city of Hazelwood just would not let me really do anything in their town, you know. I had to go in front of the board. It was a big learning lesson mm -hmm. as far as business-wise. And I cried and I prayed and I cried and I prayed. And you know, my grandmother told me, what? she said, Camille, use this as a sign because you have to stay close to God so that he can direct you. That's so right. I, I never know my path in life. I never know. But what I do know is if I stay grounded in God and pray constantly yeah. that He'll fix every need that I need. Every time. Every concern, anything that worries me. So anybody who's looking to be an entrepreneur, just know it is what you put into it because nothing comes overnight. Right. But I think I'm built for the fight. I, I know you're built for the fight. I'm built okay? for the fight. <laughs> Inside and gorgeously on the outside Thank as you. well. It has been a joy to have you on the program. You're going to be coming up soon in another program that we're going to have. But I thank you for being a part of the Christian Business Connection. Oh. Indeed, you are you are great. Miss Camille Childers, <laughs> who is the founder and CEO of Inspiring Angels, LLC. Thank, thank you. you. Thank All you. right, friends, we're going to take a short break. Stay with me. I'll be right back. The Christian Business Connection is an organization that provides advertising for businesses, ministries, and organizations through various forms of media, including radio, television, internet, social media, and much more. If you would like more information, call 314-274-2725 or go to our website, www.cbcconnects.me. Part-time job, full-time hustle, all-time shero to all of us. You nurture, we listen. You teach, we thrive. You lift our spirits, but we've got to lay down the truth. It's time for you, our Shiro, to stretch for the stars. A free online chat can give you the personalized tips you need to start boosting your retirement savings today. Start saving more for retirement so you can feel prepared and live your life to the fullest. Visit aceyourretirement.org. I know what you're thinking. I need a job. I need a new career. Well, I've been there. I've been there. I've been there. I wasn't happy with what I was doing. After high school, I didn't have a plan. I just wanted to start working. I got laid off twice. But you got to keep going. You just need the right skills. Find an apprenticeship. I found a two-year IT program. I found a medical course online. I'm now a consultant in the tech space. You have more options than you think. You can do this. You will find something. You will find something new. The Christian Business Connection is an organization that provides advertising for businesses, ministries, and organizations through various forms of media, including radio, television, internet, social media, and much more.
If you would like more information, call 314-274-2725 or go to our website, www.cbcconnects.me. Welcome back, my friends, to the Christian Business Connection television show. I'm so excited about my next guest. He's a dear friend, and he is a great, let me say, he is a great entrepreneur, and he's got some wonderful things to talk to you about. He's also the sponsor of this program today, so I'm so blessed to have with us Mr. Michael Cowsett of MSC Marketing, LLC, and you're the regional manager. I am, I am, I am. Thank you, Nona, for having me. Appreciative of you for the invite, and I'm honored today. Yes, yes. Now look, we don't, we're not going to do it any different than we do on the radio, right? Okay. So you know the question, okay? Yes. Is this the day that the Lord has made for you? It is, absolutely, absolutely. And hopefully it's the day that has opened so many doors for me with this Christian business connection through the radio. Now you're doing the TV and I'm just, oh, you know, to God be the glory. happy and excited, <laughs> yeah. you know, so yeah, yeah, let's, yeah. let's go into well, it. Well look, I want to get right to it because you have so much that we need to talk about with your services. Um, I want to say first that what excites me about what you do is not only do you provide services, but you are a community man. You love helping and giving to the community. So I want you in your own words to talk about how important it is for us to support each other in businesses and why you do what you do, and then we'll get into some specifics. Absolutely, absolutely. So when it comes to the community, yes, I love to be a part of you know sponsors, vendorships, and one-on-one -on -one that we we just recently did was Martin Luther King Festival okay. and we were a vendor there got to meet some amazing people and again supporting each other especially in a time with COVID and business you know definitely has been affected because of it I think it's so important for us to still not forget about you know yes. the people that still have to pay you know the rent and things like that so we have to sometimes I think even go out our way to su su support uh, the community and by doing that we support businesses and we can do that collectively and I, I've done it for years and I love yeah. doing it so, you know when there's good people that are doing good things and their business is thriving and I can send them you know good business and then in return they send me good business right right I love it and that's something that I, I always have been able to do very successful and yes. I'm happy to you know, do that and continue to do that, even with you and your network. Yes, and you know, even though you look like you're 16 years old, you've been in this industry for many, many, many years, haven't you? Yes, actually, <laughs> yeah, I've been actually hit the 20 year mark, you know, a specialized cable internet security. You know, we do commercial and residential. Yes. And we like to educate people really about, you know, internets and the different speeds and things that a lot of times they don't know. And with this virtual school and Zoom and everything oh that's really taking place now, <laughs> oh my. it's definitely a great education piece, I think, because some people, you know, really don't know what's a good speed to have when it comes yeah. to, you know, working from home or their kids, kids, yes. excuse me, doing, you know, virtual school. Sure. You have so many services that you offer. I know. I have taken advantage of your cable and your telephone uh, systems, you know, so I'm, I'm a part, I'm, I'm, I'm a participant in what you do. Absolutely. But for our audience, just give us some of the basics of what you do. Absolutely. So we specialize in basically bundling, you know, people and customizing, really giving them a lot of options. You know, we are partnered up with all different type of major companies all across, you know, the United States. Yeah, it's not yeah. here local. Right. I'm over this, you know, region, but, you know, like for instance, Vivid, which is a, a great product. It is. Uh, we can protect each other, you know, while we're not away. I mean, excuse me, while we're not at home, we're away and can easily see people, you know, that walk near your property. Uh, and it just gives you the extra, extra sense of security while you're away from your home. Yes. So that's one of our, our products that we really are doing a great promotion even right now, mm -hmm. where we're doing a free month, free installation, free camera, and just love, that's another community thing. We love protecting the community. It is, Absolutely. and of course you use your own services, and you've got, tell us that quick story about mm -hmm. your grandmother and how the Vivint system has been so helpful. Absolutely, we talked about that on the radio before, how Granny, she's 91, bless her heart, and me, my mother, uh, my brother, uncles, and aunties all have access to her camera. So usually, uh, she normally has to get up, answer the phone, backs, you know, kind of, you know, hurting and aching. But now with, you know, the two-way audio, you can literally check on, you know, Granny or any of your loved ones yeah. without 
them even having to get up. You yeah. know, it's literally, hey, how are you doing? You know, check right in. They don't have to get up. They talk right back. Yeah. Just great innovation. I love it. It is. It's a wonderful testimony. And families can be right there to check throughout the day, you know, and just check in on their loved ones. Also, tell us about the virtual school that you're involved with. Yeah, so actually it's more, more or less of an internship program. Okay. And what we're doing, I've actually been partnered up with Job Readiness, mm -hmm. uh, and they're allowing us to get some interns that will work for us and other entrepreneurs uh, that can basically get, they'll get, the state basically pays them hourly and we get a chance to place them. So oh, wow. I've had some amazing talent that yeah. has come through the pipelines. I've actually placed a person and just looking forward because they're ramping that back up. So there's other, you know, other businesses that are looking for that as they can reach out to me and I can definitely assist. Indeed, indeed. And of course, we're going to have all of your contact information because whenever you're on the radio show or things that we do together, you know, your phone is blowing up because people love what you offer and they're not you know, familiar. I know I'm not familiar with all the speeds and all that, but you can educate people on all that, right? Absolutely. You know, there's gigabytes, fiber optics, you yeah. know, um, megabytes. And I know it, it definitely can be confusing, you know, for people, you know, to know exactly what to get, you know. So mm -hmm. um, I, I, I think 200 to 400 is usually a really good you know, speed for maybe a middle to lower size house. And then if you got sure. a major house size, maybe 3,000 square foot or higher, you probably should get a gig, you know, which mm -hmm. is fiber optics. And, mm -hmm. you know, so the education piece that we give is is, is huge, you it know, is. because a lot of people, they don't know. They're, they're like totally clueless. They just kind of just take whatever. But we like to sit down and really give them, you, you know, confidence in what they're getting, you know, because some people are gamers and some people barely use the internet. So we use, you you know, case by case scenario and analyze, you know, what's going to be best for each person. And that's what I think separates us from, you know, yeah. anybody else. Yeah. Well, what you're saying is you, you customize, you know, it's not a cookie cutter for everyone's services that are needed. Options are better, don't options. you think? I love options. <laughs> yes. A girl always loves options, okay? Absolutely. So look, we're just about out of time and we're gonna show all the information on how people can uh, get in contact with you uh, quickly. Is there anything else you wanted to say today? Uh, just really, I'm just happy for you and, you know, being with you over the years. I've met some amazing people and I got a lot of business from this network. So, you know, definitely if there's anybody watching and, you know, reach out to Nona because she's amazing and I'd love to maybe even come back again, Nona. I really will. For sure, for sure. And I, I do have to take a moment to say thank you so much. Your, um, your belief in the Christian Business Connection means so much to me. I thank you for being the sponsor of the show today. Thank you so much, thank you so much. I know we're gonna do more together. As you said, we've been doing things for years. Oh my goodness. Absolutely. So who's, I don't know who's dating their age. You, I don't know, maybe you are. <laughs> <laughs> Not me. Right, right. All right, thank you so much. Mr. Michael Cowsett of MSC Marketing. LLC. Always a joy to be with you. Thank you. Thank you again for having me. All right, friends. Look, we're going to take a short break right here. You can't go anywhere. You got to stay tuned. We have some more extraordinary guests on the Christian Business Connection TV show. I'll be right back. The Christian Business Connection is an organization that provides advertising for businesses, ministries, and organizations through various forms of media, including radio, television, internet, social media, and much more. If you would like more information, call 314-274-2725 or go to our website, www.cbcconnects.me. Part-time job, full-time hustle, all-time shero to all of us. You nurture, we listen. You teach, we thrive. You lift our spirits, but we've got to lay down the truth. It's time for you, our Shiro, to stretch for the stars. A free online chat can give you the personalized tips you need to start boosting your retirement savings today. Start saving more for retirement so you can feel prepared and live your life to the fullest. Visit aceyourretirement.org. I know what you're thinking. 
I need a job. I need a new career. Well, I've been there. I've been there. I've been there. I wasn't happy with what I was doing. After high school, I didn't have a plan. I just wanted to start working. I got laid off twice. But you got to keep going. You just need the right skills. Find an apprenticeship. I found a two-year IT program. I found a medical course online. I'm now a consultant in the tech space. You have more options than you think. You can do this. You will find something. You will find something new. The Christian Business Connection is an organization that provides advertising for businesses, ministries, and organizations through various forms of media, including radio, television, internet, social media, and much more. If you would like more information, call 314-274-2725 or go to our website, www.cbcconnects.me. Welcome back, friends, to the Christian Business Connection TV show. I'm so excited about my next guest. She is a fashionista, a beautiful woman with a beautiful heart, and she's got some beautiful things to talk to you about today. I want to welcome to the Christian Business Connection TV show, Mrs. Alma Grinston, who is not only just a fashionista, she's an author, a speaker, an entrepreneur, and a minister of the gospel. Welcome to the Hello, CBC TV welcome, show. Welcome, thank you so much for having me. Oh, you're welcome, you're welcome. Now, there's a question okay. that I ask everybody before we start. Okay. You ready? I'm ready. I didn't prep you. Okay, I'm ready. <laughs> is this the day that the Lord has made for you? This and every day is the day that the Lord has made for me and I will rejoice and be glad in it. That's good, that's good, <laughs> that's good. You know, I'm so excited about this segment because we are introducing the lifestyle segment. Yes. And yes. Uh, you're showing the lifestyle right now from the outside <laughs> and we're gonna talk about the inside okay, too, yes, right? Yes, um, I wanna ask you what motivated you to start this business Faithfully Fresh Apparel. Yes, Faithfully Fresh Apparel is an online um, apparel and accessories boutique. And, you know, I wanted to do something that inspired women. Mm -hmm. And so, of course, I lo love fashion. I like to dress. And I always get asked about, you know, oh, I love your top. I love your necklace. And so I thought to myself, you know, this is a good stepping stone or doorway um, to begin a connection with women. Mm -hmm. um, and once we, you know, begin to talk about the fashion, mm -hmm. I can slide in an introduction to Jesus Christ. So that's, that's really right. what motivated and prompted me to start Faithfully Fresh Apparel. Yes. You know, as a minister of the gospel, you just you just can't help it. You got to talk about <laughs> Jesus. You, that's right. Oh, my that's goodness. Right. <laughs> and not only uh as I mentioned, as I introduced you, you're an author. Yes. So not only the fashion, but you know, you, the, I have one of your books mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. I'm finished with it, by the way. <laughs> I just got awesome. it a, a short yes. time ago, all right? <laughs> but I am finished with it yes. and I loved it. Thank Tell you. us about Thank the book. You. So the book is Just Believe, uh, Your Faith Shifts Everything. And you know, the book has seven interviews uh, from seven different individuals mm -hmm. talking about their specific story, mm -hmm. their testimony of faith. And I thought it was important to do this because everybody has a story. Right. Not everybody um, can relate to me and my story, right? So I wanted to get a collective group of people together so we can talk about what our walk looked like, right. um, our trial, tribulation, how we met that challenge with Christ, with the word of God and step forward. So it, it's an amazing project. Like I said, the collaboration was amazing. We were able to come together, uh, people all across the world to share our story of faith and a hope that someone would read it and their life would be changed, transformed, healed, delivered, and set free from whatever it is that they're wrestling with. Oh my goodness. And that, <laughs> it, it was, it's like the words just jumped off the page, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. And these personal testimonies that the women gave, mm -hmm. oh my goodness, it was yes. great, it was great. Yes, so how many books, uh, you know, do you think you got in your spirit? <laughs> So I, I think I have a couple. I have a couple. And it's, it's funny you say that because I've been sitting on some projects uh, for quite some time. And, you know, when the, when the Lord tells you to do something, he wants you to do it. He's going to keep probing you. That's right. Um, so I do have a project that is it's complete. I'm just putting some finishing touches on it. Um, and we're hoping to launch that this summer. Ooh. So I'm really excited about that. We do have a couple ebooks as well that are in the works. So I've been busy. I'm excited about this season and what God is doing in yeah. my life yeah. Um, yeah. to me and through me. So I'm, I'm just excited. So we, we've got a couple things in the works. A couple things, right? <laughs> <laughs> right, right, right. That's just a, a few that we can talk about yes, in this timeline. Yes. And so, you know, I, I need to ask you, what 
keeps you going because you are an inspiration, of course, in your fashion line, but also in the lives of so many women. And you know, what is it? What is it that keeps you going? That keeps you say, you know what, this this is great, but it's not mm -hmm. enough. I mm -hmm. got to keep going. Mm -hmm. So, honestly, once I realized for real that I have a mission and a purpose, mm -hmm. and that's to share the good news of Jesus Christ by mm -hmm. any means necessary. Mm -hmm. It's not about the fashion. It's not about um, the makeup. It's about winning souls for Christ at the end of the day. And mm -hmm. I know that that's what I was called to do by any means necessary. And so whenever he tells me to go now, I'm going to go. I'm not going to ask questions. I'm not going to try to figure it out. I'm not going to try to get in the way. I'm going to go. And I know that he's already made a way. He's yeah. already prepared the way. Yes. So I I believe the word says, yea, though I walk through the valley. That's so right. he's going to walk through that thing with me. So I walk head held high and I know that somebody's life is going to be changed, transformed and delivered just by my smile alone. Yes. Just yes. by my smile alone and the works that he's done in my life and the testimony that I can share with others. So I'm excited. I'm going to stop because I know I can go because my daddy is a preacher. Okay? Yeah. Oh, well. So <laughs> You said a lot, but it's okay. It's but okay. That's what keeps me going, knowing yeah. that I can touch somebody and encourage somebody and motivate them to do the work that they were predestined to do. Indeed. Praise the Lord. That's a wonderful, <laughs> wonderful testimony. Look, we got to talk about those beautiful yes. fashions that you have right here. Okay. I love yes. that stripe thing. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Bold statement pieces because yes. we're bold soldiers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, yes. Yeah. So, and we have our custom fedora pieces. And as you can see, our mantra for the store um, is Luke one. Thirty-seven. So we have that on our hats displayed because we want to make a statement when we walk in the room. Right. And we don't want to look like anybody else no, either. So no. that's what you get when you get faithfully oh, fresh. Oh, I love it. <laughs> faithfully fresh. Faithfully fresh. On the outside. And, and the inside. The inside. Glory to God. Absolutely. You know, I just don't know if I got a hat head. I said that before. You I, did. I, I want to wear that hat. I think you could pull it off. I think we'll have to do a little fashion show and, mm -hmm. and see what the viewers say. I think so. <laughs> I think we'll take a survey. Yes, do a survey. Oh, Absolutely. my goodness, my goodness. Absolutely. Well, it has been a joy. And yes. I thank you also for being one of the sponsors yes. of our yes. show today. Love what you're doing. Thank you. What an honor. What thank an honor. So and we're going to see some more of you. Okay, yes, we're going to yes. see some more of you, some more <laughs> accessories, some more great things that you do. Absolutely. I want to thank you so much. Thank you. Mrs. Alma Grinston so of much. Faithfully Fresh Apparel, LLC. Yes, LLC. All right. Thank you for being on thank the CBC television thank show. All right, friends, let me tell you, you should know how we do it by now. Okay, we take a break. We you can't go anywhere. Get, get a soda. Get something to refresh yourself so you can be faithfully fresh, mm -hmm. all right? <laughs> and then stay with me. I'll be right back. The Christian Business Connection is an organization that provides advertising for businesses, ministries, and organizations through various forms of media, including radio, television, internet, social media, and much more. If you would like more information, call 314-274-2725 or go to our website, www.cbcconnects.me. Haven't we had an extraordinary show? I told you, an extraordinary show with extraordinary guests. Thank you for tuning into the Christian Business Connection TV show. Don't forget to go to our website if you want to be a part of what the Lord is doing. Now, I say this at the end of every one of my CBC TV shows and radio shows. To God be the glory. <laughs>